Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bernardo from the BTN HD, and yes, another beautiful top five apps of the week for the Apple devices. So let's get started. And on my list, top number five for the top of the week, we have Posteli, which is pretty interesting application uh, for the iOS devices. Uh, if you are far away and you want to send a postcard, why not do it virtually? You know, send an instant message or an email. Uh, really self-explanatory. They give you multiple choices to pick from. As you see, uh, it has like three little areas that you have to fill it in. I'm going to take a quick picture of it. And once you take your picture, you could just retake it if you want or use the photo. I'm going to use the photo because I like this photo. And we're going to go to the next step. Uh, the next step is basically your title of your postcard. You give it anything that you want. Uh, so let's write the mouse. Uh, this is pretty cool, especially when you're far away and you can't get a postcard anywhere uh, and you just have your iPhone device, you can create a postcard and just send it to someone. Uh, it does allow you to edit the text. It's really minimal, so it's not something that you could do all fancy, italics and bold. Just keep it real simple. Uh, and this is the cool thing about this. Uh, you're able to put a virtual stamp within your postcard. Uh, if a stamp is if a stamp is not there that you don't like at all, you're able to purchase other stamps. But again, that's more of an in-app store purchase. And for my top number four is Duet, which is a pretty interesting app for the Apple device. Uh, it's one of those things if you want to kill time, if you're waiting for something, or you're waiting online, or you're waiting in the doctor's office, this is the game that you will want to play. Uh, it's pretty simple. You're able to go left or right uh, if you hold the button on the side it's going to rotate it all the way but the concept of it is not to get the red or blue hit on these blocks as you can see i killed myself so what's next on the list now if you enjoy flappy birds and everyone does uh you will enjoy flappy golf uh, it's a pretty interesting little game it's free which is pretty cool and i think they not too long ago added multiplayer to the mix uh with an update that they pushed out so go get it because it's, it's pretty cool and number two in the list is a pretty interesting one. If you are a person that enjoys drinking wine with certain foods to enhance the flavor, uh, but you don't know which wine to pick, this is the app for you. It's free, but again, uh, to get into it more depth into getting details of what the wine is and how it tastes, you actually have to purchase it within the app, which sucks. But you could are able to pick a certain type of food like seafood, lasagna, and it will tell you what kind of wine it would work best for that food. And for this week's top number one iOS device app of the week, yes, Family Guide. Everyone loves Family Guide. And the concept of this game is pretty interesting. As, as you can see so far, uh, I already have a small little town and uh, you, you have the characters of the TV series uh, as your people that create money and you have they have to do certain silly things to level them up uh, I love the game so far I still have it on my my iPhone device and I, I think I'm gonna continue keeping it to see how far I could get to the game and there you have it guys my top five apps of the week for the iOS devices uh, let me know what you are doing this week at the bottom of the description and I catch you guys later peace out